Hello again, friends, and welcome back to this, an even more confused Harpalab with your boy Harpalab, because now I've seen two Death Stranding trailers. Now we have a gameplay trailer. Hey, stop. Okay, now we have a gameplay trailer, and I'm expecting to be even more confused by this, because I can't watch Death Stranding stuff and not just come away with more questions than anything else. It's amazing. Uh, well, Mr. Kojima, uh, I think everyone here is excited to see... Characters. I've heard about Jeff Keighley holograms, and I've heard about, about you, Sam peeing. That's a mechanic. And I've heard nothing else. So that concerns me a little bit, because if those are the two most interesting things about this gameplay trailer, then I don't know what it's going to be like. A friend of mine said, it kind of looks like a walking about doing not much simulator. And I'm like... I mean, it kind of does. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. It kind of does. I'm sure it's gonna be amazing. Uh, Jeff, since it's uh, it's Jeff's show and everyone's so excited, I would like to show you just a little bit of it. It'll be it'll be kind of a hint to you as well. It'll be. I bet it's only a hint to the people that have watched all the other trailers and combed it all, and they're on the subreddit and they're looking at all the theories and stuff. I've got no interest in, in th fan theories because they almost always are completely wrong. I get. I get the fun of you know theorizing and all that business, but I ain't got time to waste looking at stupid theory. Oh, not, not stupid theories. Looking at theories that almost certainly won't come true. God, what an ugly game. <laughs> God, I can't believe this is coming out on PS4. It looks like a next-gen game, almost. Although all it is is scenery and one character, so I guess it's not that hard. So, Circle, wake up so you can sleep. So you can sleep with your little baby. Sorry, your BB. Is it safe, though? Well, I mean, I don't see anyone else, but it was in one of the trailers he fought some people. He's like, well, guess I'd better get up. I'll tell you what, considering his backpack is always novelty oversized, it does look extremely weightless, like it weighs absolutely nothing. Okay, this is him peeing. Oh, revolutionary! Cool. That, I can't wait to play the game and have fun stood there watching him piss. Mushroom? What? Why is there a, holo what is that? Is that a holographic mushroom? We're like, we're like a minute into the actual gameplay and I'm already confused. Why did he, why did he pee and a holographic mushroom turned up? What is this goddamn game? Who's saying that? Destination. Luden's fan. I thought they said. I thought uh, Kojima was like Luden's isn't going to be in any of our games. He's just like a mascot or something. Anybody hear me? I'm glad this game's coming out soon because I'm tired of not knowing. I'm tired of just being confused about it. I just want to play it. I just want to. I just want to throw money at Kojima and say, take my money. I want to play this game. I mean, my mate's not wrong. It does look like he's walking around doing not much simulator. Oh no, sorry. You can get a ladder out. Revolutionary. It's weird because it like if, if I was to describe what the gameplay looks like on this game, it would sound like the most boring crap of all time. But it, I'm sure I'm just sure it's going to be amazing. Better than Metal Gear Solid. Unlikely, but, you know, you never know. See, look, there's Ludens, there's the Kojima Productions mascot. I'm pretty sure when they were kept showing off Ludens a couple of years ago, Kojima was like, nah, he's not, gonna, he's not in one of our games. He's not, like, the, the main character or anything like that. Well, there he is, look, he's in the game. I mean, is, the, is this in the game, or is this just for the trailer? This would be the Jeff Keighley hologram. Delivery terminal, make delivery, what's this? Return lost cargo. Okay. What does this have to do with rain that makes you old, though? And ghost hands. Hey, look, it's Jeff Keighley, huh? 
Yeah, so like... What does this have to do with anything else they've shown in the... What does this have to do with the guy with the golden mask and the giant Shira lion? And... and... Ghost babies, and oil handprints, and dead whales, and naked Norman Reedus, and people exploding into nukes when they die. What does any of this have to do with anything? What's happening? Floating dog tags, for some reason. Shiral network coverage. Yeah, what's the Shiral network? Okay, so that's like America then? Okay. Shiral network coverage. Oh, the hologram quality has greatly increased. And then you just vanish. Okay. So I'm so confused. So he's got. What's he doing? What's this? So. So he put dog floating dog tags into a machine. How janky was that? That was, so, like, so unrealistic. When he landed, it didn't... Oh, that was weird. They'll probably finish it before the game's over. Oh, no. Baby's crying. So he... So he put... Those babies are nightmarish looking. I'm not gonna lie. Cool. You can rocket, rocket to sleep. Crying babies. That's what I want in my video games. So he put floating dog tags into a machine. And that transferred a package over to Jeff Keighley. Don't, don't fall off cliffs is something I've learned. It's pretty obvious that you shouldn't fall off cliffs. Look how fast he's going. That was like a really... Him sliding down hills is like a really janky animation. It's really out of place in a, in a game that looks otherwise really realistic and everything. I'm not going to lie. Hang on, let me, let me just see if there's anything else. No. I'm not going to lie. That was pretty boring. <laughs> so he... So he, he so you can piss and grow holographic mushrooms. You can walk around in an empty, barren environment, which I already knew. You can climb a ladder, which I already knew. You can transfer packages via dog tags and, in, and improve the Shiral network, whatever that is. Again, I'm more confused than before. And it's not... That trailer wouldn't... Um, it wouldn't put my friend's mind at ease with his fear that it's just going to be a walking around and not doing much simulator. Because that gameplay made it look like a walking around and not doing much simulator. Not particularly impressed by that trailer, quite frankly. Um, I'm still loving Death Stranding, of course. I'm, I'm still going to get it. But uh, I'm just more confused than ever. Every time I watch one of those trailers, I'm more confused. So that's that. That's three Death Stranding trailers. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and all that business. Follow me over on Twitch, because I do some streams on Twitch and stuff and things. Everything's all in the description down below. I've got a Discord on there. I'm over on Twitter. I'm always talking about stuff. Like, most recently, I'm complaining about the new combat pack. Well, not doing much complaining about the new combat pack trailer, because I wasn't expecting it to be good. My, ex my expectations were low, but holy fuck. So there's that. Thanks, and I'll end it properly this time. I will actually do my usual sign-off, not, not a warped version like I did recently, and I will say peace and chicken grease. <laughs>